personality is amazing. And he's very humble, quiet. I mean, I know a lot of times we have this vision about attorneys that they're tough, they're mean. You can talk to them, you can get close to them because they're so used to being in the courtroom fighting with judges. But he's very different. He's very down to earth. You would you wouldn't think that he was he was an attorney. Let's talk about professionally. He's very dedicated to his clients. Um, every person that comes to the office that he hires. I mean, I've been working for him for 10 years and everybody gets trained. He tells us, you treat the clients as they were your family. I understand that, you know, we're making business, you know, we do, you know, we, we're doing a lot of, you know, advertisement, we're doing this, we're doing that, but, uh, you know, you need to, you need to be respectful to them, you need to, you need to treat them as they were part of you because you don't know when you're going to find yourself in that situation. Personally, I mean, when he comes to the office, he's always happy, he's making jokes. Of course, there are days that, you know what, you can go through certain things, but um, he's, he's very, he, he's like your friend. You can come to the office and you can speak to him anytime. He takes care of his employees, he always has our back. If someone talks bad about us, he gets upset. He takes good care of us. <laughs> Wow, I think it's amazing that he's getting this award, the Community Service Award. He is a leader, and I truly hope that a lot of businesses out there watching, you know, can watch this, this video, uh, and people that are here tonight as well. He's an inspiration. I think very few attorneys, very few businesses do a lot for our community, for us, the Latinos. Uh, muchas veces nosotros los Latinos venimos a este país somos muy exitosos, pero pocos negocios hacen algo por, por su propia gente. Bill doesn't look colored. Bill doesn't look race. Um, he's been working a lot for us, para los Latinos. He gets up every morning and buys the coffee and bread to give it to our labor workers. I've been working for the office for 10 years, and I've, been, I've seen that. I mean, he has a lot of employees that can easily go out there and do it, but he is the one who does and buys, you know, the turkeys for, for Thanksgiving, for example. He goes to the, to the supermarket and buys 120 turkeys. He can ask any of us to do it, but he loves to do that. And, I, you know, I really do hope that a lot of businesses can, can follow his footsteps and can actually do and give back. He, he has this philosophy. He says, listen, as I'm getting back, as I'm getting from, from, from clients, I want to give back. And that's actually amazing. I think it's important to me because there's a lot of businesses out there and a lot of businesses that could take the opportunity to give back to the community. And it's, it's not that difficult. Um, you just you know find the right organizations that, that your firm can engage in and it's good for your business, it's good for the morale of your staff, and, and, and most importantly, it's good for the, the organizations that, that you can help. And, and when you're doing that within the community that, that you know, where you work, it, it makes it feel kind of special. What drives me and, and, and my firm is, is really that a lot of the organizations we, we help are what I would call a hands-on organization. Strong, you know, being, being probably the most prominent of that, that, that you can see that you know, Strong is, is making a direct impact on kids. You know, there's a lot of great organizations that, that do research, whether it's for cancer and other types of diseases, and that's great, and, and, and people should contribute money to that. But smaller grassroots organizations like Strong and, and, and Pronto and other, other local organizations, you know, they're helping people right here in the community, and I think that's really important. I think what makes Strong different and unique is, is that it's all about the kids. Um, it, it's not easy being a kid in today's society. It's even more difficult being a kid in today's society when you live um, in an underserved community, um, a community where there's questions about whether the school district is, is, is really has children and their best, you know, the best interests of children at heart. Um, communities where oftentimes children grow up with, with one parent rather than two, where Violence is, is something that they see every day, not just on the news, but in their neighborhood. Um, and so Strong's trying to help these kids, trying to help these kids get that edge that they need to, to, to get through their childhood and, and develop into, you know, strong 
young men and women and, and, and productive adults, and I think that's really special. You know, our work is being acknowledged by, by a, a group that we feel very strongly about, by an organization that, that really cares about people. And when you get an award that says, you know, it's a community business award, um, you know, it's a great recognition for me and, and most importantly for my firm and my employees that, that, that really get involved in, in, in what we do. I mean, you know, last year my son was involved in, in running a, you know, a free soccer clinic um, at the Strong Camp and, and the connections that he was able to make and the kids who asked if they could follow him on Instagram and, and you know, it was, it was really touching for him and, and because of that and, you know, because of those connections, it, it, it really makes it special to, to be, to be acknowledged in this way. Thank you.